They call it the Monkey Gland Final. Wolverhampton Wanderers meet Portsmouth. Wolves reported to have monkey gland injections are hot favourites. I never heard of monkey gland while I went to Wolverhampton. And, and we started having a needle up my backside, so... But whether it, whether it uh, did you any good or not, I don't know. In February that year, Bert Barlow joined Portsmouth from Wolves. He told his new club about the injections. We had one a week at, at Wolverhampton. Then when I was transferred to Portsmouth, we had two a week to catch up with with what Wolverhampton had. had. The irony of it is that uh, both clubs went to the final. The monkey gland that they were talking about, it, it was a... It was a big nonsense. <laughs> that was the biggest card trick you've ever come across. Whatever the truth, there'd never been hotter favourites than Cullis's Wolves. Somebody had said, oh, well, of course, this match, it won't be worth watching, really, you know. Uh, as if we were so invincible that, <laughs> that we could dismiss Portsmouth or anybody else. Country to Morgan, Morgan with another tie one. He's a very dour player from Dundee, Morgan is. Tries to hit it to Barlow, and Barlow gets it finally. And Portsmouth have scored! The most unexpected score. It goes to Barlow, who shot from just the edge of the penalty area and left the Wolves goalkeeper absolutely no chance. This ball come loose, and I just smacked it, and in it went, and that, that was it. We were on his way. Portsmouth put four past the five to one on favourites as the Wolves defence had a dreadful day. No one could believe it, not even the Pompey fans. Even I did a little a bit of a, uh, a jump in the air with excitement, and that is uh, not often I did anything like that. The only thing I really heard was the Portsmouth supporters when they together were singing, play up, Pompey, Pompey, play up. Uh, when the, one could hear that, that came out loud and clear. Pompey supporters are practically jubilant. As well they may, here go the famous Pompey chant, play up, Pompey. Wolves' autocratic manager, Major Buckley, was deeply embarrassed by the result. On the way to Wolverhampton, he got off halfway because he didn't want the public to see him get off at Wolverhampton. They were all waiting for him, and some of these hooligans that shout at matches, they were probably ready to give him a real dusting over. Portsmouth held the trophy for seven dark years while the nation fought a more serious contest. <laughs> 